We went a year and a half without a director. And I was invited as president to go to the American Association of Museums meeting. And there was one speaker that I circled, and that was Jim Harithus. And the first and most important thing that I remember him saying was, we have to develop our own art community. We have to recognize those among us who are really good in every part of the community. And he did that. But Marilyn, remember it, how he did the exhibitions? The ex he brought such music and liveliness to them. Music was an important part of every exhibition. And what it ended up doing is everyone wanted to come here because the openings got such a great reputation. And it wasn't just a place, as you said, to, to view art. It was a place to go have fun. So Meralda is a Spanish artist who does food works. And so he and Jim were great friends, and we asked the Rainbow Bread people as a contribution if they would make like, I don't know, it could have been 800, 1,000 loaves of bread, but every loaf a different color. The idea was to bring in the Kilgore Rangerettes and have them march around the building and build the wall of bread. And the wall extended from the far parallelogram corner to the other dividing the museum in two. But the wall started getting tall. <laughs> you know, there's music going, and meanwhile, more and more people are pouring into the museum. Someone decided they were going to take the bread and throw it at another person. That was the beginning of the famous bread fight. And some of the artists were so offended over what was happening that they actually went and uh, hit the people who were, th who were taking the bread and throwing it at other people. And several fist fights were started and then the police were called and the whole place got shut down. And two people, I saw one woman knock a man out downstairs. <laughs>